if I have a hope for my work, I think it's that I hope people will question, that they will see the work, they will look at the work and they will question how the animal died and why the animal died. So um, this is the kitten that was donated by the woman who um, taxidermied it um, using a book out of the library. And so it looks like home taxidermy. You can see it's um, had quite a rough life because it's been well loved. So the start point for the artworks is the animal itself, particularly if I have been given the history of the taxidermy when it's donated and I try and work that history into the artwork and I try to create that visually. I think that taxidermy, when you see it, it's in sentimental poses, you know, it's serene, it's got some lovely representation of nature there. And this is the opposite, this is quite unnatural. And I don't particularly want it to be serene because the um, violence that was inflicted on it was anything but. I do use vintage brooches and vintage beads in my work and I adorn the animals. Um, this is about honouring and giving them value and um, there can be kind of a bit of repulsion with taxidermy and this is creating a push-pull so that when you look at the work you're attracted, it's sparkly, it, it looks lovely and then at the same time you're repulsed because the animal is dead and you know you might question how did it come to be dead. I'm also exposing some of the um, aggression that the human has inflicted on the animal because I'm looking at the taxidermy and stripping back some of that fur and finding bullet holes and knife wounds that are being stitched up that are in the skin and then I'm emphasizing those with the choice of colors and so the jewels they have incorporated into them this red which represents that violence but you also have the beauty of the jewels which is the beauty of the animal itself. I'm not sure if I'm trying to remind people what the animal has suffered or whether I'm saying, you know, we're all responsible because as humans we're exploiting animals all the time. And here's another reminder of, of um, what we're doing to all animals. So really the one work represents our entire relationship with animals.